Good evening and welcome. My name is Aaron Burt and I am a certified financial planner with the Certified Financial Group in Altamont Springs. This is the first of a series of webinars that Certified Financial Group University, or CFGU, will be presenting. At Certified Financial Group, we developed this concept a CFGU to help provide general education to the public about investment topics, and in doing so, hope to become your resource for all things financial. This webinar will be recorded and posted to our website with all of the future webinars as they occur. We will be taking questions during the presentation, but we'll be answering them offline, so feel free to type questions in the chat box or shoot us an email after the uh, webinar is complete, and we'll be more than happy to answer any questions you may have. This first presentation is called Investment Basics 101, and we're going to discuss the basics of investment planning. We'll start by discussing some fundamental concepts, and then we'll review some investment options that are available to you and consider some general investment strategies. Finally, we'll spend some time discussing how you might go about allocating your investment dollars. And in the end, I hope that this overview will assist you in thinking about your own investment needs and may help you determine whether you may benefit from working with a certified financial planner professional. So let's begin. First, let me pose a question. What does investing mean to you? So some of you may associate investing with speculating or gambling on a volatile or uncertain value of assets in the hope of obtaining potentially higher returns. So for example, trying to time the market in order to make a quick profit and others may see investing as more of a long-term, methodical effort to save for the future. And in fact, investing is a little bit of both. All investing involves a certain amount of risk, including the potential loss of principal. And there can be no ironclad guarantee that any investing strategy will be successful. Investing also involves the potential growth of your money over time. So consider investing a carefully planned and prepared approach to managing and accumulating money. Investment planning is about discipline and patience, but it doesn't have to be difficult. So an important concept to understand when it comes to investing is the impact of inflation. Inflation has the effect of reducing the purchasing power of your dollars over time. According to the U.S. Department of Labor, the average annual inflation rate since 1914 has been approximately 3%. So at a 3% annual inflation, something that costs $100 today would cost $181 in 20 years. Think about that for a couple minutes. Well, maybe not minutes, but seconds. That's, that's a lot. I mean, your, your purchasing power is definitely going down. But let's, let's look at it from a higher point of view, more money. Let's say you have $200,000 stashed in your mattress. Assuming a 3% annual inflation rate, that $200,000 will buy you just over $108,000 worth of goods and services in 20 years, and less than $60,000 in purchasing power in 40 years. This means that if your investments aren't keeping pace with inflation, you're actually losing purchasing power each year. It also means that the real rate of return on your investments may actually be less than you think, something you'll need to take into account. <clears throat> 